This is dedicated to the ancestors that have gone before us. A celebration of their histories, their culture, their stories, and their lives. Now, our elders tell us that uh, we were always on the continent of North America, at least some of us. And just recently, they found evidence that we did not come across the Bering Strait, that we were there before the Ice Age. Our elders were right, we were always there. We were always here We were always here We were always here like the prairies and the sky We were always here Like the trees and mountains high We were always here Where the hawk and eagle fly We call this land our home Every rock and every stone And we were always here We are the people, we are the ones We have always been here, many moons and many suns Mother, she feeds us, cradles us to sleep She is our children, she's not ours to keep We were always here We were always here Like the wild horse and the loon We were always here Like the stars around the moon We were always here Like the river's ancient dew Our mother is this earth She is our ride over And then the world changed. New people came from overseas, bringing new music and new sounds.
imagine what our people must have thought the first time they heard the bagpipes, the strange new sound from across the ocean. They must have thought it was their ancestors talking to them from the other side. Just waiting for the night birds to call On the wind came a well like no earthly sound Our grandfather's calling us all It was a song of change Things would never be the same Who knew what the future Ancestors calling me home. Song was sad and high, coming from the sky, made us feel so sad and alone, like a soul. Lost or a loved one that's gone, or you're far, far away from your home. It was a song of change, things would never be the same. Who knew what the future? being First Nations at this time. And it wasn't easy being an immigrant for Scotland. And it wasn't easy being Métis. Métis is a nice name for half-breed. Thus people that were somewheres in between. Please. 
place to go Some say that I am English but Some they call me French Some even call me Squaw But I pretend I don't hear them Some say you don't look Indian What are you doing here? Prejudice works both ways, I fear Half-father, half-breed Somewhere's in between I am a Métis Never would I see No tree rights No place like whites Métis don't fit in society's scheme Just be people underneath the sun. Why can't we just be human when all is said and done? Half breed blood is red like anyone. Half father, half breed, somewhere's in between. I am a Métis, never what I see. No place like that Made it on fit In society's scheme Half breed don't fit In this country's dream Oh, oh, no Oh, oh, no Oh, oh, no No place to go Oh, oh, no Oh, oh, no Music we had never heard before. Me la mar fishcat a go. He did it, he did you. Ask him, he never can go. All he do, all go. All he do, all he do. Harry, you all go. Ask him, he never can go. He did it, he did you. School time, oh, he has more come. All he do, all go. All he do, all he do. Harry, you all go. School time, oh, he has more come. He did it, he did you. 
When the fur traders and explorers came to Canada, most of them took Aboriginal women to be with them so that they would know the right foods to eat and the right clothes to wear. These fringes are not for design, they are for, to wick the water away so they wouldn't die of hypothermia. And uh, some of them needed these women to show them where to go, to guide them. In fact, uh, Jefferson commissioned Lewis and Clark to find the Pacific Ocean, and they probably wouldn't have done so if they had not found Sacagawea, who showed them the way. She was taken as a child, worked as a slave, Sacagawea, Sacagawea. She became the wife of an enemy brave, Sacagawea, Sacagawea. But he lost it to Mady in a gambling game. She was his property when Lewis and Clark came, Sacagawea, Sacagawea. Little bird woman was her name. Charbonneau would beat her and his second wife too. Sacagawea, Sacagawea. He became the guide for the Lewis and Clark crew. Sacagawea, Sacagawea. But she was Shoshone and her people were the ones who treated their famed horses for the white man's guns. Sacagawea, Sacagawea, little bird woman was the one. It was Shoshone country, and she knew the trail. Sacagawea, Sacagawea. She knew the medicines that helped make them well. Sacagawea, Sacagawea, they never would have made it to the big water bay. But she knew the talk to keep the enemy away. Sacagawea, Sacagawea, little bird woman knew the way. Son, and she called him John Baptiste, but they took him off to school somewhere in the east. Some say she died of fever when the traveling was done. Sacagawea, Sacagawea. Some say she left Charbonneau and went out on the run. Sacagawea, Sacagawea. And married a Comanche on her journey west. And finally reached her people before her final guest. Sacagawea, Sacagawea, little bird woman stood the test. Now, these same fellows often had wives and children back in the home place, and they called these girls they took up in the new land their country wives. And often, when they were done their tour of duty, they simply left them alone and went back to their old country.
that tell us who discovered this country. legend that when Aboriginal people pass on to the next world, we become stars. I wonder if this is true. at the stars there's a new one and maybe but for fortune or luck go you or I maybe there is peace on the other side and maybe there's no soul
Hudson's Bay, a blonde-haired Iroquois, a Belgian half-breed Indian guide in a brave court of war. He guided through the leather pass where the Fraser River runs, and he swears he made his cash in food and fur and guns. Dijon, Dijon. And met this lady there, a woman of the mighty Cree with long black flowing hair. They raised a family, trapping fur, and gained respect and fame. Along the path to the great borders and the road that bears his name, Dijon.
about the clash of the two races and cultures. This story comes from the battleground of the Little Big Horn. And 
hill Branches black on the sky The leaves have all blown They wither and die But the branches will bloom They were only asleep We are the tree With the roots that go deep We are the tree With the roots that go deep The roots they go deep As time passes by We are the tree That is too old to die Sometimes we love Sometimes My old Kukum was four years old when she crossed the border into Canada with her father, Sitting Bull. Because the Calvary did not bother them when they were in Canada, they called the border the Great Medicine Line. Medicine line, heading north of the 49. Leave your troubles far behind you. Running for the medicine line on the trail of the lonesome pine. Nobody's gonna find you. Long ago, great white queen, they called her Kukum ruled the land. When the cavalry came to take them down Door to the border they ran They were running for the medicine line Heading north of the 49 Leave your 
troubles far behind you Running for the medicine line On the trail of the lonesome line Nobody's gonna find you In the time of Vietnam When things did not look right They ran from their native land Instead of going off to fight They were running for the medicine line Heading north of the 49 Leave your troubles far behind you Running for the medicine line On the trail of the lonesome pine Nobody's gonna find to live in a country like Canada. We can only be thankful. In Cree, thank you is hi hi, and in Ojibwe, it's miigwech. This next song is based on an Ojibwe prayer. Miigwech, hi hi, thank you creator for another new and wonderful day. Miigwech, Hi, hi, thank you, Creator, for all of the good things you bring our way. Megwitch, hi, hi, thank you, Creator, for the four leggeds, two leggeds, winged ones that fly, for those ones that crawl and swim in the water. For the wolf's lonely howl and the bald eagle's cry. Megwitch, hi, hi, thank you, Creator, for another new and wonderful day. Megwitch, hi, hi, thank you, Creator, for all of the good things you bring our The sun and the moon and stars in the sky For rainfall and rainbows and earth that we walk on For rivers and lakes and mountains so Creator for all of 
clothes to wear, the homes we live in, the food on the table and bed when day ends. Make a witch, hi, hi. Thank you, Creator, for another new and wonderful day. Make a witch, hi, hi. Thank you, Creator, for all of the good things you bring our way. Sing one. Make a witch, hi, hi. Thank you, Creator, for another new and wonderful day. Make a witch, hi, hi. Thank you, Creator, for all of the good things you bring our way. For all of the good things you bring our way. People came from Jasper National Park. When they made it a park, they decided that everybody that lived there had to leave. There were many Métis families living there. They had homes and farms and friends. And they were forced them to move 100 miles north of there. It was a long trip along the way people died. They had to go, they took their guns. In 2009, they did a commemorative ride back to the old home place there, bringing the youth, the descendants of those people back to see where their roots were. It was a life-changing experience for some of the youth. The documentary was called A Long Road Home, and this is the title song from that documentary. Timbuktu to Rome 
It's a long road home. It's a long road home. These many miles remind me of hope and broken dreams, of promises and falsehoods. Life's not. As far as walking from White Horse to Stockholm, it's a long road home. It's a long road home. And we wonder why the new town doesn't want us here, and we know they try to make the boundary so far out. We must leave once more, unwanted on our own land. Cannot leave this shore. It's as far as walking from Perth to San Antonio. It's a long road home. It's a long road home. It's as far as walking from Shanghai to Cologne. It's a long road home. It's a long road home. To quote an elder. You can't know where you're going if you don't know where you came from. Knowing your roots is essential for youth of every culture. And Larry Riel said in the hundred years after his lifetime that the Métis culture would be revived and come back in its full glory, and it would be its musicians and singers and writers and artists that would bring it back. This kind of tells my story as a, Mount, as a Métis girl growing up in the Rocky Mountains of Alberta. This where I was born and raised. I learned how to ride and hunt in nearby people's ways. Times they were changing and I had to move on. And for a while that mountain girl was gone. I've been a college girl. I've been a diamond girl. I've been around the world. Yeah, I rode that rodeo. I've been a city girl. I gave that life the world. But a mountain girl is who I am. Crystal Springs sings a happy song. But when I reach those mountains, gone the heartache of the past. My mind's a piece 
to get land rights for the Métis people, and for this they called him a traitor, and they hanged him. Now, it's been recently decided that what he did really wasn't wrong, so they decided they were going to pardon him, but we think he should be exonerated. Saskatchewan and Battle River flow. They fought an ancient war, the Redcoats and the Cree, and the Mady Five beside him for a half breed called Lou. Depends who tells the story, but for those who knew him well, they know he was no traitor. Louis, Louis Riel. Well, they hang him high for treason, the creatures by his side, for fighting for the freedom, the land respect and pride. For him there is no pardon. But a hero is what we see in the valor and the vision for the happy call. Navajo 
Anasazi means something like ancient alien ones. It's hard to leave a place that you love. 
or someone you love. And it will be hard to leave here tonight. You've been a terrific audience. Leaves are gold and crimson And the summer sun is gone There is no work for me here, so I'll be moving on. Oh, my heart is sad and aching, I'm already missing you. Leaving is the hardest thing to do. This road takes me away. From the hills that are my home From one who really loves me And I feel so alone There's no telling when I'll get back From where I am going to Oh, oh. Places that I have to go are not where you belong. Only time can heal the sorrow and the pain I'm going through.
100 years after white contact, more than 10 million Native North Americans lost their lives in one way or other. Warfare, disease, starvation. This show is to honor their memory, their histories, their stories, their cultures, and their lives. It's a celebration. because of you and in my soul you are my sister and our hearts sing the same tune well once there was just darkness you began the moon well once there was just sorrow the heart has given